Boom. Hello there, welcome back to Pokemon Sapphire. Last time we had a really boring episode here in the Trick House. Yes, we are done 100% for now. We have two Trick Houses left. There were no battles at all. Let's get back to Fortree City and keep actually going. Make some progress. That was the worst episode ever last time. I'm sorry about that. Just, uh, I could have, like, gone to the internet and checked up a guide for the questions, but, like, no. No, that's not how I roll. Let's go, 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 make progress. Yep, the least amount of grass over there. Da, ba, 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 hey there! Oh, no, it actually starts raining, nice. Do you have any moves that can strike a flying Pokémon? Actually, all moves, but ground-type moves, can strike flying Pokémon. So you would guess that I only have ground Pokémon with only ground-type moves, then? Better keep calling. That's odd. Oh, Natu! It is raining. It is raining. Mirror Coat? No, goddammit. Hmm... I thought it would use, like, Confusion or something like that, because it's Psychic, so... Counter. Nightshade. Ghost-type. Oh. Wait. Oh. Oh, wait, Ghost is physical? Really? Really feels like it shouldn't be, but okay. But that is a set damage move. I guess that's why it doesn't... Uh, it's not super effective. Nether. Yeah, good job, Shio. Swallow. Well, Shroik almost leveled up. Was almost leveled up. So we just failed the gym battle there. Severely with all those double teams. Rain continues to fall. Oh, 20 damage with a crit from Quick Attack. Yeah, I'm okay with that. And that's, that's what a real critical hit should look like. Yes, I just taught you that. Shroik is over level 30. Well, is level 30 in the 30s. Good job, Shroik. You saw it above me. Mm -hmm. Genetic bird thing. The move fly is convenient, don't you think? While the Pokemon is flying, almost no moves can strike it. Thunder can. And I believe... There's an, one other. Can't think of it right now. Uh, I'll give Frodo a little bit of front action here. Oh no. No, 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 not Frodo. No, 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 that's for Sturz and that's for Sturz. I hate her. I remember her. She is my nemesis. Hi there. Me. Pokemon and my parasol. If any one of them is missing, the picture of beauty will be ruined. I hate this girl. If it is this girl, I know she's on this route. Yep, it's her. Parasol Lady Angelica would like to battle. She... I've had so much trouble. This is one of the most difficult trainers for me in the past, at least when I was younger. Because her Pokemon is so freakishly strong. Casserole. It's not her. It's not her. Okay, thank God. Whew. Oh, and it's it's raining, so it's gonna change to its water form. Ah, that that works out for me. Hey, cast form uses forecast to transform. I think the ability is called forecast. So now it's water type. It feels like the water type cast form is the transformation it has that you get to see the most. Oh, and now he uses hail, so now we'll see the other one. The one you get to see the least. Whoop. Snow cloud cast form. Then there's also, if it uses sunny day, it will become like uh, a fire type. Now it's an ice type. Ice type, huh? <laughs> Whoosh. Mm, yes, you cannot hide from me no matter what type you are. You've completely ruined my beauty. When I was a kid, I was all, all 
not only a kid, up until fairly recent, only a couple of years ago, so we're like, oh wait, why why is there no sandstorm form of of Castrum? Like the the fourth weather. And then I saw like a comment online like, oh yeah, that's that's the only weather that has nothing to do with water. Because rain, water, hail, that's ice, water, and sunny day, that's the absence of water. But sand, just blowing sand, has nothing to do with it. A parasol wouldn't suit you at all. Why, something like this would only get in your way. There she is. That's her. That's my enemy. Pokémon have many special abilities. If you want to become a first-class trainer, learn about them. I've actually lost to this one. I've lost to her before. Oh, yep, yeah, it's the yeah cool trainer Jennifer. Here we go. Milotic. Hey there. So it is. It heals itself a lot, so let's start with Leech Seed. Just so we have something on it that keeps draining damage. Because it has Recover, a oh, Water Pulse to confuse you. I think it, it has Recover, maybe Aqua Ring to, for like passive recovery. It is a real tough one, especially if you don't have anything that's super effective against it. Now I, luckily I do have stairs in here. Do -do -do -do. So maybe I'll be lucky here. You see, you deal almost no damage. It's freakishly defensive. And then Water Pulse. And because it's a cool trainer, she she's also able to heal it with the uh, Hyper or Super Potion. This is a tough one. We're just gonna have to... Gnaw it down. Maybe I should try a strength instead. Maybe it has doesn't have as high normal defense. Just its special defense is high. Perhaps. Or the pulse. Pulsey pulse pulse pulse. No confusion, that's good. Yeah, and it also has rain. There's always raining on this route, so it has its water moves powered up. Strength. Yep, healing. There we go. Full restore, even. That would have gotten rid of any status problem. Does that get rid of... Leech Seed? I guess we'll see. It doesn't. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Good. Good for me. And strength was better, yeah. So it's high special defense, which does help it... Whew. Good job, Sturson. And that's a lot of expert health points. Sturson, group level 33. You're obviously thinking. Thinking about what? The special abilities of Pokemon will make battle styles change. Whew. Got through that one without much, too much trouble. That's good. Now let's now let's put Frodo up front here. I saw there was a ninja boy up here. Ooh. We ninja conceal ourselves under our camouflage cloaks. I bet you didn't know where I was. Okay, let, let's let's say that I didn't, so you'll be happy. Ninja boy Tsunao would like to battle. Ninkada. Frodo. Go Frodo. It's part ground typing is confusing me though. Mind reader. What moves do you have that requires impeccable aim? That works. Mm. That works too. But I feel like it's unnecessary because it's not gonna faint from it. Let's try rock throw. We go experimental here. Another mind reader. Hmm. Let's see, that it should... It wasn't. It wasn't super effective, so the ground typing gives it uh, defensive powers against rock type moves. Hmm, interesting. Very interesting. That's, that's good to know. It is main bug part ground, so yeah. But it doesn't protect, the ground typing does not protect against fire. Like, I wonder what the logic is behind that. So the, the, does that mean that ground the ty ground typing is more resistant 
to rock moves than it is to fire moves. Because it is resistant to both, really. But what determines... Or is Bug weaker to fire than it is to... Uh, oh yeah, fire type moves are weak in, in the rain. <sighs> Freaking show. You go. Yo go. Y yo go. Yo. 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 Ninjask. Ninjask on Merode Daralla. Counter. No, not this. Not this. Please, not this. Not, not, not that. And then. Uh, speed up. Does it need to have speed booster ability? It does. Okay. I'll speed boost. No! And I don't want to switch now! God damn it! Uh, and it's so slow, and it's so slow, and rain continues to fall, and then speed boost activates. This is like the f one turn with all these extra things. It takes like the time of three turns. Uh, counter. But it failed. Really? I hate you. I fucking hate you. Uh, What's with this weird... I, were Pokemon trainers smarter before in earlier games? I don't remember that being a thing. Why do you spam... And like, with stat boost moves and things like that, they never spam anything. But here, Double Team is apparently very spammable. Oh my god! What the hell is this? I'm gonna go ahead and use a Destiny Bond. Try that. I don't think that's a... Is that affected by accuracy? Let's actually check that. Check that before we. No. Yes, I know. Yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah, it no accuracy. It's just this thing. Double team. Ugh. You can use six of them. That was that five or six. Destiny bond. Good thing. I'm expecting sh to die, so... Yes, you're very fast, and you're very evasive. Oh, and sword stance, now we're doing that type of boosting as well. Destiny Bond! Doo -doo 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 -doo. Do I only have five of those, maybe? Doo -doo 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 -doo. Yep. Sword stance, god damn it! God damn it, it's getting super boosted! I can just hope for it to attack me and not keep boosting. And then I have to go with... Yes, Fury Cutter. Thank you. Oh, well. It's one of those moves that gets stronger which is with each use. And it is super effective. Though I only have one left. Yeah, last Destiny Bond. Here we go. Yes, thank you. Yay, yeah, bye. Whew. No one gets experience points though, that's sad. Screw you. I lost. I should camouflage my shame. I will beat you up. Our camouflage clones are all handmade. Screw you. You made it so that I have to go back, all the way back. I have no time for your bullshit, Meryl. Run! Run away! Yeah, I'm fast-forwarding this running back thing, by the way. I will have forgotten until I get to this point, most likely, but then I will be like, I have to go back. So from beating the trainer, fast-forward now until we're back at that point. Yes, great! Ah. Oh. No, please, pl please say, well, oh, please tell me that that was the last annoying trainer. Because I don't have time for more annoying trainers. No, that was the wrong side. Ugh. Zigzagoon. Oh no, Frodo. Can't escape because you're so freaking slow. Sand attack. 
maybe shouldn't have gone with Frodo. I can't escape. Oh, yes, thank you. Let me just get the hell out of here. No! Surskit, ooh. That's sort of interesting, though. That is sort of interesting. Because it's semi-rare. I don't know how rare it is over here. But Surskit, that is... It's bug water. One more ember. Bubble beam. No, I'm not fine with that. Don't burn it. Thank you, and we'll just catch it. Uh, with a great ball. Yes. Look at this great ball, Suskid. Wouldn't you want to be inside this great ball and just stay there and have a great time? Yeah, you do. Suskid State was edited in both legs. Pond Skater Pokemon. If Surskit senses danger, it secretes a thick sugary syrup from the tip of its head. There are some Pokemon that love eating this syrup. Give a nickname to the sketch. Yes. Yes. Your name shall be. Um. Um. Amgyu, not Amigo, but Amgyu. Amgyu is into the PC. One thing I always disliked a bit about Surskit is, well, I like its typing, like the bug water thing, but when it evolves, it loses the water. It, when it becomes Mask Rain, it becomes bug flying, and it's super generic, just like ma so many other bugs already are. So that's kind of boring. Uh, by the way, I do have that PP up. I don't, I don't care whatever I said before, let's just put it on overheat. Put it on overheat, put it on overheat. Do, 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 do. Let's have a fleece get back here where we were. Oh, I need cut to... Oh, and there are berries up there. Oh, I... Yes, berries. They're just berries. And I'm going to end this episode here. But don't forget to like, I'm subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye, 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 bye. Yeah, Watch a video.